Hello! It's me, Hugh Edwards. We've had four days working here uh, in the room together, which for us has been the first time in this past more than a year that we've been able to do that since COVID started. And we've tried to design something um, that will work for an audience watching at home, but also for a live audience. Luckily, we're using uh, Egin, so S4C's headquarters, and it's a perfect facility to be able to do that um, here in Carmarthen. The last few days have been kind of a culmination of the things we've been playing with online, of bringing it into the room and seeing how we can meld a live performance with using Zoom and the functions used on Zoom um, whilst maintaining social distance and keeping COVID safe. It's been very interesting and very entertaining. We've had some funny moments, had some good laughs, and if I'm honest, it's been brilliant. It's been a lot of fun, it's good to actually do something together, not on Zoom, but actually meeting and actually working together in person. See people in the flesh was brilliant. There are so many elements of what we've done before that have come into this. Really like made Zoom fun again, um, with everybody just like gelled so quickly and it's just been like, we've, we're always laughing. We played loads of like uh, drama games and like exercises like that. That was all on Zoom and when we got here, um, it's kind of become quite different. Uh, so someone's peed in a sink in 10 Downing Street and there are a number of suspects, a number of members of parliament who it could be um, and we've basically got to work out who it was. It's been taking all the things we've learned from the games we've been playing with, with the improv we've been experiment, experimenting with and trying to put something together to show or like a work in progress piece. Kind of a fun mystery like who done it type thing we've come up with in the end. I think the reason why this piece is so kind of crazy and good is that we, we just weren't worried, we just did what we did and um, then somehow Ben managed to create it into something uh, comprehensible I suppose. It's quite improvised so we're really in the hands of the audience and the audience online as well. We started the first session on the Monday with a very simple game that we had been playing on Zoom. It's a kind of question and answer. You who me, yeah you, not me, etc. and it passes around the group. What's been really interesting as often is, is the conversations that happen in the downtime um, between the group because a lot of the National Youth Arts Wales uh, members, they're at that point where they're kind of moving away and going to university, to drama school and so our artists have been having those sorts of conversations with them about what they're up to. I think what's, what was really struck everyone is the support everybody's given each other if someone felt a bit unhappy or unsafe, we've helped everyone through it. That be a very supportive person I am, and I just am pleased to be proud they are, they do it, and uh, same as mine, and I'm just happy for them and myself. Thursday, I was a bit nervous, but now, on the four days, I just having fun. It's my last day here, so I think um, I say disappointed, and this be um, extremely fun for for our great production. I've loved working with the members of Hijinx because this is a process that they're really used to, and they are so comfortable just to uh, uh, to play and to nudge and to and to let anything happen. I've been able to come out of my shell a bit or have that weight to just. Um, kind of explore and perform has been fantastic.